how do you find out that you find out that he's locked up and he's telling on everybody and, and getting everyone else locked up? Would you do a song with Takashi after you got out? Hey, motherfucker, no. I don't even want to connect to that now. <laughs> I'm good. You know? That's why I be telling motherfuckers, you got to keep these rappers like rap. Yo, these are just rappers, baby. Are you from the hood? You supposed to know that these are just rappers. Don't expect nothing from them. These motherfuckers was, had everybody locked up. You know what I'm saying? These entertainers. You know what I'm saying? That's why I say from these kids, too, when you look at these entertainers, they just entertainers. They ain't, they ain't living that shit they be talking. You understand? Ah, my boy Bobby Schmurder. The king of toting that thing. The motherfucking creator of the Bobby Schmurda dance. I used to do the Bobby Schmurda dance all the way from the crib, all the way to Mexico, from Mexico back to the crib. Just caught a body about a week ago. Fuck with us, we get the tweaking ho. Run up on this niggas, get the squeezing ho. Ooh, ooh, ooh. He has some stuff to say, man. I like it when people honestly speak out and they talk about situations like this. When Snoop Dogg says, hey, man. If you're not about that street life, stay out of that street life. When you get a guy like Lil Boozy who was facing a death sentence. He was facing a death sentence, my nigga. And he still didn't tell on, tell on anybody. I like his perspective view on it. I even like when, when somebody talk about a situation. Because you got to actually experience this shit in order to give your thoughts on it. If you ain't ever been in jail before, I ain't trying to hear what the fuck you got to say. If you ain't never caught nobody, I'm not trying to hear what the fuck you got to say, my nigga. And 6 ix case is pretty much different. But Bobby Schmurda, he a real ass nigga, my nigga. He took more years so Rowdy Rebel can get out early before him. Half y'all niggas wouldn't do that for your homies. But honestly... I agree with everything that Bobby said. Like, yo, bro, like, I don't want that nigga nowhere near around me. That nigga didn't told. He's singing in there like Patti LaBelle. But honestly, we should all should have known that this was going to happen, bro. We knew that this was going to happen. Like, come on, bro. You really think a colorful... I, I mean, I don't know anymore. Nowadays, a nigga will blow you a kiss and then they'll shoot you. So I don't know what the fuck is going on with the rap game anymore. But at the same time, I just saw it in Takashi that he just, he just not cut from that cloth. If you look at his fans, they're all Caucasian or probably, I don't know. I think they're all Caucasian if you look at his performances. But come on, my nigga. But the Schmurda gang has spoken. Schmurda, she wrote, has spoken. Who the fuck is texting at me on a time like this, man? Who the fuck is this? I'll look at that shit later. But my boy, Bobby Schmurda, he's about to be back out here in these streets. And I can't wait, man. 6 9 whenever you get out, I don't know when you're going to get out. But when you do, you need to become a monk because you can never rap about killing anybody. You can't do anything about that. You can't rap that shit no more. You can't even sing it. Make Spanish music or make Gotti music because you can't pick up gangster rap no more. You're no longer a gangster, my guy. I'm sorry. It is what it is, man. Every thorough nigga said that, yo, if you're not about it, that life, stay away from the streets, bro. But what y'all think about Bobby Schmurda coming out, man? Y'all ready for GS9 to take over? Ooh! I still remember when he threw that hat in the air and it never came back down, man. Yo, free Bobby. We waiting for you, man. I'm out.